He's been bringing the law to the main streets of Mega City 1 for more than 40 years. But where do you begin if you want to get into reading Judge Dredd? The Judge Dredd The Complete Case Files series has been publishing the complete stories of the lawman of the future in order for more than a decade, and they're still the best way to get to know Dredd and his world. But with more than 30 books and hundreds of stories, getting started can be a bit daunting. But you don't need to pick up every volume, you can start anywhere with Dredd, and here are our top 10 stories to get you hooked. Number 1. Hit the Streets So what's it like on the streets for a judge in this crowded metropolis of 800 million people? The Graveyard Shift in Case Files Volume 7 doesn't just explore the crazy, wacky world of Mega City 1, it also shows what an average night is like for a street judge. From a left-hand killer to crime swoops, from illegal bike clubs to block wars, this typical story of Mega City madness from regular writing duo John Wagner and Alan Grant combines their signature traits of blazing action and black humour. On the flip side, The Pit is a sprawling street-level epic contained in Case Files Volumes 24 and 25. Dread takes over as chief of the most crime-ridden, most corrupt sector in the city. It introduces a whole cast of supporting characters who must deal with mountains of paperwork, violent mob bosses, corrupt colleagues and even unjudicial liaisons. This is a modern classic, a filthy procedural epic to rival the likes of The Wire or The Shield. Number 2. The Apocalypse War the mother of all epics, the Apocalypse War and its prologue Block Mania are contained in Case Files Volume 5. When multiple block wars erupt, Dredd discovers it's no coincidence and just the prelude to an all-out attack by the Soviet forces of East Meg 1. Nukes rain down in epic scenes as fleets of Strato-V aerial units descend and the judges fight for survival. This was Mega City 1's darkest hour. But Dredd leads a brave guerrilla resistance against the invading Sovs. Blockmania contains work by Brian Bolland, Mick McMahon and Ron Smith, but it's Dredd's co-creator Carl Saskela's art on Apocalypse War that steals the show. This is a true epic in every sense. The ending alone is mind-blowing and has had fundamental consequences ever since. Number 3. Judge Death Judge Dredd's ultimate nemesis, an undead alien superfiend from another dimension where all life has been declared a crime. Judge Death has returned again and again to slaughter the population of Mega City 1. Pick up Case Files Volume 3 for the chilling first story of this most popular of Dredd's villains, and Volume 5 for the introduction of his terrifying cohorts, Judges Fear, Fire and Mortis. Years later, the Dark Judges returned in Necropolis when they took over the entire city. This breathtaking epic in Case Files Volume 14 is one of the high points of the strip, a dark, horrifying story that pits dread against death itself. Number 4. Oz Contained entirely in Case Files Volume 11, Oz is one of the classic epic dread storylines. Marlon Chopper Shakespeare is a graffiti artist and sky surfer, that's racing on levitating surfboards of course, who escapes from a Mega City 1 ISO cube to take part in the Super Surf competition in Australia, but first he has to cross half the world with Judge Dredd hot on his heels. At the same time Dredd faces a force of mysterious fanatical Judge clones called the Judder, who teleport into Mega City 1 to kill, and their trail leads to Oz. Part road trip, part sports movie, part adventure romp, this also features incredible work by Brendan McCarthy, who worked on Mad Max Fury Road. Number 5. Mechanismo Forget Robocop, this is the real machine law. Short on manpower, Justice Department turns to robotic judges to make up their numbers. Trained to analyse and execute in an instant, the Mechanismo droids are deployed on the streets despite stern resistance from Judge Dredd. Of course, things don't go smoothly, and before long the bodies start piling up. This story explores the nature of the judges and their brand of justice, while also boasting beautiful Colin McNeil painted artwork. The original story is in Case Files Volume 18. Number 6. Democracy Now! One of the strengths of Judge Dredd is his ability to tell episodic, long-form stories, and the greatest of these is the democracy storyline. It begins with Letter from a Democrat in Case Files Volume 9, when a group of pro-democracy terrorists take over a television station and are brutally gunned down by the judges. A huge pro-democracy march then springs up following the massacre, but it's undermined by Dredd using dirty tricks. 
Madrid has always been a satire on fascism and right-wing law and order politics, and this is the storyline where John Wagner and Alan Grant drove home the point, as Joe persecutes ordinary citizens hoping to change the system. To get the main stories, you'll need Case Files Volumes 9, 11, and 16. Number 7. Dread vs. Zombies in the 1990s, a young writer you may have heard of called Garth Ennis took over writing Judge Dredd and soon set about killing over a billion people. Judgment Day sees a mysterious necromancer called Sabat raise the dead and send them to attack the living. The battle becomes desperate and cities are overrun and even nukes can't stop the tide of the undead. It's not exactly a subtle storyline but it's packed with action and plenty of gore. Plus there's a song and dance routine at the end. You also get the awesome sight of two of 2080's greatest characters, Judge Dredd and Johnny Alpha, fighting head to head and then side by side. Pick up Case Files Volume 17 for the whole epic. Number 8. The Day the Lord Died What happens when an egotistical madman somehow becomes the one in charge, wants to build a wall and goes a bit mad? bit too close to the bone? Well, back in the late 1970s, Megacity Womb was rocked by the takeover of Chief Judge Cal, former head of the Special Judicial Service. He framed Judge Dredd using a robot double, bought in alien mercenaries to police the streets, appointed the goldfish as his deputy, and vowed to kill every single citizen in alphabetical order. Can Dredd stop him before he carries out his monomaniacal plan? This is one of the maddest epics in Judge Dredd history and The Day the Lord Died is contained in Case Files Volume 2. Number 9. The Judge Child This is Star Wars by way of Homer's Odyssey as Judge Dredd leads a crack squad in search of the Judge Child, a powerful telepathic kid who it's claimed by Justice Department psychics is destined to rule Mega City 1 in its darkest hour. This brilliantly bizarre and often surreal epic introduces the formidable headbutter Mean Machine Angel before Dread heads into space and encounters everything from carnivorous planets to the terrifying jigsaw disease, which erases sufferers block by block. Pick up Case Files Volume 4, but also check out Volume 8 for the follow-up City of the Damned, in which Judge Dredd and Judge Anderson travel into the future to find Mega City 1 destroyed, and because of something they did years before. Number 10. The Cursed Earth Imagine Mad Max mixed with Damnation Alley and you have The Cursed Earth, the first true Judge Dredd epic. Over on the west coast of America, Mega City 2 has been struck by a terrible disease that turns citizens into insane murderers. And with the spaceports in their hands, the only way to deliver the antidote is for Dredd to cross the irradiated Cursed Earth. He's got to face dinosaurs, mutant gangs, flying rats and even the last president of the United States. So if you're looking for the maddest, most nail-bitingly insane moment in Judge Dredd, then this is it, and it's included in Case Files number 2. Of course, you could always start from Volume 1 and work your way through one of the greatest ongoing comic series of all time. But we hope that gives you an idea of just some of the highlights from the Case Files series. Don't forget to support your local comic book store and ask them to order the Judge Dredd The Complete Case Files series through Diamond Distribution. Until next time, citizens.